Hello and welcome back. I'm Christine Corrado. With me right now is Cisco Sapena. He's a CEO at Yeda.net. Cisco, great to meet you. How are you? Fine. Good to hear. Cisco, if you could describe the company's business and a little bit more about the e-signature area. Well, uh, basically, Yeda.net is a telecom uh, operator who is devoted to become digital witness for electronic for electronic contracts and claims. Let's say that when you have more than 100 customers, they, they are no longer customers, they become consumers. And you know that consumer is always right. And the consumer tends to use some economies with the truth, just tell 10%, 20%, 30% of the, con, of the truth. So you need a trusted third party who verifies what you have sent or what you have received from that consumer. Okay. And at the end is what we do. And we have developed methodologies where we have granted patents worldwide and is a service that we are offering world, on a worldwide basis, which is basically being a digital witness of what you have sent or what you have received. So since you are in the digitization business, can you maybe describe how the coronavirus has impacted the company? Well, uh, totally total win. In a way that, uh, well, obviously, uh, doing electronic contracts and claims, let's say it's in the middle of the process of a digitalization. But meanwhile, the natural process or the older processes were going, there was not a hurry, especially in a middle size and small size business, to digitalize their process. Okay. But because the COVID, Obviously, uh, with everyone in lockdown, every that, well, all companies were forced to do it to digitalize themselves, including their most of their processes, because people um, were very afraid of going to the office. There was no people at the office, <laughs> so uh, well, and obviously everything has to be done online and with digital digital signatures, uh, doing digital contracts, because, well, during, especially f since the lockdown, it was totally impossible. So for us, well, it was, was perfect. <laughs> was perfect in a way that uh, everyone needed to do it electronically, everyone needed to do it online. And that's the way we become the, the, the start of the, of the European stock market being able to multiply by, by nearly nine the value of the company and, and the stock markets. So can you just tell me how much business you have acquired because of this? Tell me about your recent contract announcements and, and maybe how you're expecting these to contribute to future growth. Well, uh, during this, this, every quarter we publish uh, all the data. Um, and for example, during the last quarter, we grow in the, in the SaaS business, which is basically the digital contracts, digital claims, registered services. We grow that about 62%, okay? And this is gonna continue because uh, every week and uh, we are signing new contracts. We are a company that is very active in um, for um, providing information to the market, which which companies become more customers. For example, the last one was uh, Generali, the, one of the biggest insurance company in the world. It, it's well, it's going to to use our services, uh, and, and basically any company who is dealing with consumers, actually they need uh, the 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 kind of services that we provide. So I know you are based in Spain and you do provide the service around the world. Are you planning on expanding into the US because you did recently list your shares on the OTCQX? Yes. Well, the company itself have, actually we have uh, five patents in the US regarding our methodologies. Uh, we are starting now and it's one of the reasons why we become listed at the OTC because uh, thanks of being listed, you are uh, doing this interview with me. <laughs> and, and, and thanks to being listed, we are explaining what we do and how we are doing and how we might help in the, in the US market because not only be, because the digitalization, but also because the privacy issues, okay? Remember the CCPA in California 
and there are many more coming in 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 more states in the US where the um, all these kind of, of information, the privacy issues, okay, uh, the, the, the people is going to need a tool to communicate the companies who have their, their databases that they are included to be excluded, okay, and also the companies needs to uh, notify the, uh, the, the, well, the consumers that they are no longer inside, okay, and the penalties may become up to 2,500 US dollars each, okay, only in California, who knows in the others. <laughs> so this opens a huge market for our services in the US. Well, I'm looking forward to following your achievements here. Cisco, thank you so much for the time today. Thank you very much. We'll be in touch.